Hey everybody, it's Darlene and Emily, and we're here to talk about publishing your site. You're ready to put it out there in the world, but maybe you're a little bit nervous. That's okay. We're gonna show you how to publish your site, and if you're still a little bit hesitant to publish, stick around and we'll share three best practices for ensuring your site is ready. From the website editor, if you're ready to publish your site, all you gotta do is click the publish button. That's it. At this point, you can go and view your site and see how it looks. We know it can be scary to push that publish button, but once you do, it's not set in stone forever. You can always modify or add content and publish again. Publishing your site gives you the ability to share the link with friends, family, or even trusted established customers and ask them for feedback. If you're still nervous and you don't know if you're ready to hit that publish button yet, here are three things to make sure your site includes. And if it does, take the leap and push that button. Number one, let's talk about your homepage. When you started your site using Website Builder, this is what you were creating. The first thing you and your site visitors see is your header with a message. So make sure your header is simple and catchy with a clear call to action. This means have a button that directs your site visitors on how to take the next step, whether that's signing up for your email list, browsing your online store, or even buying a product. Number two, make sure you've explained what makes your business unique. This usually displays in an about us section or page. So tell your customers what sets you apart from other businesses like yours. This includes your contact info and location. This information can be great to add in the footer section of your site. Number three, make sure the look and feel of your site is complete. Ask yourself if it matches your brand identity. Did you use your brand colors? Is there a nice balance of text, images, space, and color, and do things flow together? Every piece of content on your site should be vital for customers to know. If it's not, then remove it. This also includes your site structure. If you have all of your content on your homepage and it matches the above criteria, then you're good to publish. If you created different pages for your content, just make sure that those pages are well organized and that there aren't too many. Okay, those three best practices will help ensure you have the basic building blocks for your site so you can publish. And remember, your site doesn't have to be in its final form in order for you to publish it. You can always make changes as your business grows. The important thing is that you put it out there for the world to see. I'm Darlene, this is Emily. Now go publish your site.